What's going on, ladies and gents? Three, we're here for T3G along with Full Throttle. <laughs> Forgot his name Delay. for a second. Delay. Forgot his name. And today we're going to do our pretty quick TV roundup. Um, yeah. This week, we really only have one regular show to talk about. We're going to talk about Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Right. And then we also have the new iZombie show. Uh, it's four episodes. It's been about four episodes. Four we episodes. wanted to give it a chance. We didn't want to kind of judge it off of one shot. Right. So we wanted to give it a chance. So we got four episodes in, and we're going to talk about that as well. Let's start with Agents, man. Yeah, let's start out with Agents and get that knocked out. Um, Overall, pretty decent episode. We had a little bit of action between Coulson and... <clears throat> What's the other guy's name? I keep forgetting it. Yeah, so that... <laughs> Uh, we saw, you know, we saw um, Fitz and Gen uh, Gemma. Fitz and Gemma do a little switch around. That was uh, great. That, that was great. Cool. I was a that little was worried. Cool. I was a little worried just for a second. But as soon as he saw it, and he was yeah. like, "Why would she be doing that unless?" And then I was like, "All right, so she's with him. They're yeah, they're, yeah, they're yeah, on yeah. the same so page." That was that was cool. And um, you know, we got a little bit of talking back for. I'm glad I was incorrect. I'm glad Bobby did say what she said. And yeah, you were absolutely. Right on that yeah. Money. And you know what? And he lost. You know what? And that dude lost any credibility when he when he yeah. referred to Sky as a, as a thing. And yeah, 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 yeah. And she's like, uh, she's a Shield agent. What the hell's wrong with you? Yeah, absolutely. And the other thing, uh, I believe they are on an island. I mean, we haven't been shown. There's mountains, but they could be on an island, like you said. They might be showing us the island because they said elders. Isn't that something you were talking about? Well, the el yeah, I'm thinking the elders might be either like a ruling council or it might actually be referring to the uh the actual royal family right um the elders could be something a little different but if it's the the royal family then yeah that'd be cool right. uh, i i don't know i don't know i read some things online that people were talking about they probably won't show uh black bolt in the royal family and i would say probably not black bolt right probably maybe medusa Right. I would say maybe Medusa, yeah, I don't just think because... We'll, I don't think we'll see Black Bolt, just because it's like a really main character. That's, yeah, we that's the main... We don't see Iron Man, we don't see Thor, we see Sif, but we don't see Thor. Right. So, like, I don't think we'll the, see uh, the main character. The reason I don't think they're going to do... Uh, the reason I think that they will do Medusa is because even in the comics and even on the you know Fantastic Four TV series, cartoon series, um, Medusa is kind of the first introduction to the main heroes right. of, the, of the Inhumans. So... You know, we have kind of a taste of the inhuman life now. Mm -hmm. um, I love the fact that her mom's alive. I completely forgot about that he, she was alive. And well, I didn't even know she was alive because last time I, we saw her, she was lying dead no, in his arms no, in the desert. No, that wasn't. That wasn't. There was a moment after that where they showed her just for a second, and I was like, she's alive. And that was, I completely forgot about it. I forget which episode it happened. Well, I don't remember that. So. But she showed up, and she walked in the room, and I was like, hey, mom. <laughs> like, that's what I was expecting from her. But then I was like, wait, she doesn't know. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. She has no idea what her mom but looks like. But at the same time, she could have said, the, all the things that she said to her was like. But she did give her a weird look. After she said it, she gave her a weird look. So you're thinking, because all the things she said to her was like, I'm obviously your mother. I would like to get to know you. Right. But if you don't want to stay here, we don't have to see each other again. Yeah, yeah. No, she did definitely give her a weird look. Um, so I think she might, like in the back of her head, might be thinking something. I wouldn't necessarily say she thinks it's her mom. Somehow, something, this I, woman knows her type oh, of deal. I, I kind of expected her to go ice queen on him. Uh, when she when she went to the room and talked to the the dad, mm -hmm. uh, I wanted her when she gave him that hug to just be like, like stab him. Me too. I was waiting. That's for what it. I was expecting. I, I was, was like, just like, it. can we end this dude? Like, he's just an annoyance at this point. But I mean, does he? It's weird because they keep messing with like he might have some kind of ability as he well. Does. What rage? Yeah. But I mean, he can't like he can't do anything. He's not powerful. Like, I think he's just strong. Rage. I guess. I think he's strong. I think rage fuels strength. I would like to see it. I I think we have, but just it, I don't think it's anything like extreme. Because remember, he had that like misfit group of people who kind of had powers, right? I think that's kind of the level he's at. He's like got something, but it's not really that good. Okay. So right, I think sure. he kind of made himself I an inhuman, you. right? Which is why why the guy told him like, yeah, you know, you're, you're nothing. You're, you're a lab experiment. experiment. Yeah. So, yeah, but overall, I mean, I thought it was a good episode. I wouldn't say great or bad, but it was it was an okay episode. I enjoyed it. Um, I don't know. I just would like to see how this plays out with this other shield. I'm still not happy with it. I'm still not happy well, that I it's think... just another shield. And, I mean, li listen, like, 
maybe I don't know about I keep forgetting his name. The other the big guy that was with Bobby Mac. on this. Ma- yeah, Mac, right? Mac. Mm-hmm. Um I can see why Mac would never think Paulson's Some construction going on. Construction. Um, do we want to wait for this? No, I think we're. I think the mic's doing a pretty All right, good, good job. Just keep well, it whatever. Here. Uh, so Mac, I don't think we'll ever see Colson's side of things. I think he's always gonna be delusional, thinking that Colson's like the bad guy. I don't think it's. An, uh, I don't think it's so much a delusion. I just think it's a matter of perspective. It's sure. Either, okay. It's fine. either secrets or transparency. I mean, those are your sure, two options. Sure. Uh, you, well, that's the thing. Like they say, transparency, but like this guy gave gave a reason why you know that guy should have shot at you know uh uh sky like he was he was like against it It doesn't matter like what if she was left alone you know what if she was left to do more type of deal like she he's just looking for yeah oh no 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 No, i'm I'm not giving him i'm not giving him any credit i'm just saying that those are the two so supposed that that, that transparency bullshit clearly those guys are out of their mind where at least colson wasn't like oh let's just kill shit so, um, but I don't know. I, I mean, we'll see. I mean, Bobby seems to be second guessing some of the decisions here, which is cool. But um, I don't know. I just kind of want to see. Obviously, they're setting up civil war, from what I can tell. Mm-hmm. I mean, they're clearly setting that up. I like so. the fact that Mike's back. I like the fact that he's got. Yeah, upgrades. Mike. Yeah, that was cool. It was cool seeing Mike. When uh, I was wondering who, I was like, are we gonna see Hulk or something? Like, <laughs> like that'd be cool on TV. Uh, no, it was cool to see Mike. Uh, I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, we haven't seen him in at all this season. And when did he, when did he disappear? At the no, end we saw last? we saw him. I thought, no, you're no, right. I don't think we've seen all. him this season. Not at all this season. Uh, yeah. Well, th- last season he, well, he disappeared. You know when the whole shield thing happened. Okay. When the whole Hydra thing happened. Okay. Because uh, they sh- they showed him uh, training right. at a shield facility right before that, like a right, couple right, episodes right, before right, right. that. So I mean. He probably just, you know, jumped jumped ship at that point. As yeah. soon as the Hydra thing happened, he probably got got out of Dodge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. So yeah, that's. I mean, I like I really, it. I really don't have much else to say about it. It was a decent episode. Um, I just hope there's more stuff happening. I don't. I don't like the episodes where they're just talking. It uh, feels did, like it's did, no. Did you episode. Did you like uh, Did you like how um, I don't know the guy, the new guy's name, uh, but tomorrow people guy. <laughs> I guess he is from that. Yeah, he is. Um. How he was having like electric sex with Sky. Yeah, he was, was like, was, "Hey," was she's like, "I feel it inside I me," and I was like, it. "Really?" I bet you do. I was like, what uh, are you doing? <laughs> no pun intended. But uh, it, it, uh, you know what? I think I think it was a good episode. I like, uh, like I said, I, I hope they bring out at least a little bit of the royal family because I think the two characters we could see from right. the royal family are either Medusa or Crystal. Okay. Both of them had exposure to non-inhuman characters previously, right? Um, and uh, Crystal. Less so, but tr- after they, after we saw the Inhumans, right. Crystal like was the most visible one. Sure. She joined the Avengers and everything. Um, so I think Medusa or Crystal will kind of be the best, uh, the best kind of way to bring in the royal family without actually showing everybody. Because mm-hmm. um, that would just just effects wise, that would be too expensive. Right, right, right absolutely. <laughs> um, but I think we'll get a little taste of it, and uh, from there they'll kind of build more into it through the movies. But this. I don't know, man. We were talking about this might set up the Civil War, but I feel like it's already almost done. There's only two episodes left. Oh, wow. Um, but I feel like it's already almost resolved, right? Because look at it this way. Bobby's second-guessing it. Right. They took the, they took the cube. Right. And um, Coulson's on his way. Like, he's got he's got one of their ships. Well, and he's yeah, got access. but I mean... So, so like... I don't think it's, it's going it to end already, there, though. That's it, the thing. No, no, no. I just mean, like, it already seems like it's pretty much resolved. Nah. I, I don't think it's... I don't think this will be the thing for Civil War. I don't think this will be... I think this is part of... I don't think it will. I think it is. All right. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Right, let's uh, let's talk about iZombie. iZombie. I... Four episodes. Really like this show. I enjoy it. I, enjoy I really it. like this show. Uh, it's, it's a super enjoyable show. It's a little more campy. It's a little more... It's like a fun show. Let me put it this way. I enjoy it more than Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. That's not really... <laughs> that's like a low bar. That's that it, that is a low bar. So that's you enjoy it more than Constantine. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Do absolutely. you enjoy it more than... What was the other show? Gotham? Gotham. 
at the current moment just because Gotham started out good, but then they just went somewhere. See, that's why I disagree. I think Gotham kind of started weak, but got better. uh, I I think they started good. Um, They did get renewed, though. Yeah, they definitely got renewed. So and be constantly might two. be getting renewed. Um, I would say at the current moment, just because of my disappointment with Gotham, yes, I would. Like I to um, definitely not more than Flash or Arrow. Well, no, no. Uh, That's... But yeah, I enjoy it. It's a good. It's a good series so far. Mm-hmm. Uh, I really like it. I like it. They're they're taking this. It's kind of like a fun comedy series, right? And they just, like, threw in the zombie sprinkle. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, I've never read the... Oh, man, that was oh. a really weird cough. Uh, right. I've never read the comic series. Right. But um, it, from the show, it, it seems like they really wanted just to have something fun. Right. And then it's like, all right, well, let's throw in this, like, this is, like, the the, the foil for the show. The sure. foil is the fact that she's a zombie. Right. You know, like, she just beat this dude half to death freaking bloody eyes with veins and stuff on her face yeah and he's like what are you lady you're a freak yeah. and like nothing's gonna come of that no nothing like th- no one's gonna take him seriously like this chick might be a zombie right and like the other zombies aren't like out murdering masses is like taking people off the street right and turning them into like gourmet meals in right, this last right, right, episode right. which i thought was hilarious she, he's got like a chef that's like making these yeah, fantastic like chef. i've got a mix of, what was it um uh, it was a cerebral brain, or something like, brain matter puree yeah. to make give it a little uh, give it a little it, more. I was like, that's awesome! This it is was, hilarious. It was it was pretty funny. Um, Greatest transition to killing those two guys though. Turns around, he's like, "How's your new startup coming along?" He's like, "Oh, no, don't give it much like, thought." He's like, "You're gonna you're gonna paint in here, like something like that." Like, don't give it much thought. Bam, splatter. Yeah. Um. I. It's funny. Uh. I was gonna mention. So the guy, the the blonde hair zombie, he's yeah. always gonna be Sark for me, from uh, Alias. Sure, sure. Well, <laughs> it's funny because he was a zombie in his own movie. It was a comical zombie movie. Like he he was buried and he got out and he meet his friend and he's like, he like it was hilarious. It's funny that he's a zombie. Oh, I'm gonna again. have to check that out. Yeah, he's I'm a gonna have to check that again. out. He's a zombie again. So yeah, I like him. I've always I've seen always little bits from his acting and i always enjoyed it so i like him as uh, that character i think he does a, well, a very good job i enjoy the girl the girl's actually doing a good job as her character i don't yeah. she's not like over the top or anything she's got mm-hmm. this badass part to her but like i said a lot of women don't know how to play the badass part or let me rephrase it a good amount of women in acting industry, they overact the badass part. Sure, sure. Uh, when, she when they're seems, tough, they try to be more, right. more than necessary. Where she seems like when she goes into full zombie mode, uh, she seems to handle that pretty good. Yeah. She seems to handle that pretty good. It's not over the top, I don't feel. Um, yeah, just, I like... It's just a good, good it's amount kind, of it. It's kind of like a Hulk out, but right. like more controlled. Because she still has that moment where she can pull it back. Yeah, yeah, Which yeah. is great. Um, I like... I like how they've used that. They don't rely on it too much. Yeah, yeah, they no, don't. Absolutely. They don't do it every episode. No, yeah. Um. I, I. It's just kind of a. It's a defensive tool. For yeah. Her. Absolutely. Uh, the like, main thing that they focus on is divisions, and I thought that was a really cool. Yeah. I think cool that's thing a cool that they added concept, in. Yeah. Now, what I think is, I think she's unique in that. I don't think anyone else gets that. Right. So she maybe had like a specific genetic trigger or something that right, worked sure. a certain way. To give her because it doesn't ability. look like the other guy gets. Yeah, because yeah. I mean, I think they would be using it for personal gain as exactly. well. Exactly. You know, he's he's a businessman. He's a drug dealer. So what Clearly. did he do? He created a need and then created the drug. Yep. Or supplies the drug. Supplies so, the drug. Yep. I think it's interesting. I like. I really like the entire setup of the show. You know, there is this. You know, you've got the friend who knows, but is, I think that's pretty cool. Like, I, yeah. like he takes it like, like he was just like he's like it's, it's a Tuesday afternoon. It's cool. It's cool. He was like, so yeah, he's like, can, I, cool. can I just check that out real quick? Just take some samples. Right. Like, she's like, you're not freaking out? Like, no. Why, why would I be? So lately I've been on a kick for Sriracha, and I do like the fact that she uses Sriracha on her brains. <laughs> <laughs> that is cool. And I like, again, I like the fact that they, when they talked about, like, I think in the sec- second or third episode, they talked about uh, the taste of it. Yeah. And yeah. how it has, like, a weird, weird, like, uh, texture, so yeah. that's why they put it in with other food. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. the guy made in the last episode, he made a he made a puree like a, a smoothie out of it. Yep, so that was cool. Did. 
Yeah. And uh, when the guys walked in, with, when the you know with the big muscle muscle zombies came in, <laughs> so that was funny. Hilarious. They came in and he's They're like, he gave, about, the, he gave them the, the gym and stay. Yeah, well, fit. He t- yeah, he talks about giving him. He, he, it's like I know you guys don't like carbs. <laughs> somebody gives him that little yeah. sample. He's like, oh, I'm definitely eating this on my cheat day. Yeah. I was like, you're a zombie, bro. <laughs> you don't have cheat days. <laughs> you don't need cheat days. You don't need. Right. Uh, I was just. I just think it's a. It's a fun show. It's just it that's, is a fun that, show. That's kind of the biggest thing for me. Is like it's a fun show. It's it's not too serious. This because so, even in this last episode, it was super serious. I mean, like it was serious, undercover was vice comedy, gig, right. like undercover vice gig. The dude got kicked to death. Yeah, like there's some serious stuff being dealt with, but it's just it's kind of fitted into this really funny show yeah. that it's not that serious. It's not that it's not serious. It's that it's it, it's framed really well. You know, even the serious stuff because like her relationship, her right. having to deal with this. The fact that she, like, walked away from an engagement, yeah. walked away from her family. Like, the, everything that happened in the first episode, I thought was, it, it had the potential to spring either way. Oh, it had yeah, its yeah, potential yeah, to absolutely. go kind of, like, really too, dark. Too, yeah, right. like, dark and serious with some comedy for no reason. Right. Or the way it went was a funny show where they kind of make fun of the fact that there's zombies and make right. fun of the fact. Because even in the second episode where she found that zo- the girl who went super zombie mm-hmm. that had no way back. Yeah, yeah. That, I love that it they seemed, were testing it, it the like theory. It seemed out of place. I love that they were testing the theory. Exactly. Though. It I seemed out of place. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like that moment with her being like an actual, you know, the, the way we classically know zombies, it seems super out of place. Uh, I mean, I was okay with it because that, I mean, that I, shows I just mean like not, in the tone. Sure, but that seems like what, what it shows me is that not all of them will be human zombies type of deal, I guess, would be the living zombies. Like, the living like dead, Like thinking yes. zombies, I guess, would be the... <laughs> Not all of them. Obviously, they are able to go too far yeah. to the point where they just, they're zombies. They're brainless, you know, flesh-eating zombies type of deal. But um, I do like, uh, one more thing about the actress, I do like that she's able to play all the different emotions that she gets from the brains very well. Like, she yeah. doesn't... The like, I know Kung Fu to, was great. That was great. That was, that was I know great. Kung Fu. Whoa, I know Kung Fu, like, for <laughs> real. Yeah, right. <laughs> Um, so I, I enjoy that. Yeah, overall, I think so far, it, it's one of those, you know how I was talking about, like a show has to grab me, grab mm-hmm. my attention, and that's usually that first episode that's going to do it. Well, for me, it was, it wasn't a full, like, hey, you know, you're good, you got me, mm-hmm. like, I'm going to just watch every episode, but it was there was definitely some kind of grab where it kept my attention, and I wanted more. Um, definitely so i i enjoyed it. i i like the so far in the four episodes i like the series uh if they continue the way they're going um i i enjoy it i like it i want to see what's going to happen between her and the other guy that's going to be interesting you know if, how if they're going to fight it off or you know because at some point she'll figure out that he's you know supplying zombies and stuff yeah because like at one point she's going to eat a brain that's going to show him doing something you know what i'm saying right exactly so. it's, it's she, she's well she in this episode this last episode that they uh the one dude his new enforcer uh took the shoes right right right, right and right. she made note of the shoes when yep. she met that kid yeah, sure did. um so i thought that was uh that was going to be the the thing that like maybe next episode or in two episodes where she sees that enforcer maybe with yeah. the guy yeah she's gonna be like I know those shoes. Yeah. This is where we're going. No, no, I agree. Absolutely. So definitely something's going to happen there. I like it. I enjoy it. Once again, it's better than Constantine or, or Gotham at the current moment. I think uh, I think it definitely has good potential. Mm-hmm. Um, I can't wait to see how the season goes. Uh, like I said, the first four episodes so far is really good. And I guess this gives us kind of like a spring show. Yeah, which is which rare. Is cool. Usually you don't have a spring show. Uh, especially not like a superhero one, right? But now we do. Yeah, hey, I'm know? okay with it. I'm okay. I like it, and I believe we're also getting the Walking Dead spinoff in the spring as well, or summer. So that's coming out really? in a little that's bit. It? Yeah, I thought they were just going to launch it with the mm, next season. No, they're, that's coming out here in a little bit. Wow. Yeah. Okay. From what I understand, that's coming out in a little bit. So we might have two shows to review during the summer. So. Oh well, dang! All right. Know. Yeah. All so, right. But otherwise, yeah, those are my thoughts. I don't know if you want to add anything else. No, that's pretty much it. Uh, I really liked, you know, I like the agents and I like the, I definitely like iZombie and the way it's going. I mm-hmm. think it's got a lot of, like you said, potential. Yeah. And um, it'll definitely, it's going to be a fun ride for, for iZombie, definitely. And I'm interested to see what happens in these last couple episodes of uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Quick note, I don't know if you saw it, but uh, they're talking about an Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. spinoff. So I'm going to leave you with those thoughts. 
Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. If you have any questions, make sure you drop them down below. Make sure you check out T3GTech.com, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that good stuff. As always, I've been Cerebro. Full throttle. Signing off. Why you gotta scratch yourself when we're doing videos? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you?